Hi there, Kathleen Packard, and today is day 21 of the video challenge through Internet Lifestyle Network, 100 videos in 100 days. And today is all about making money your slave instead of you being a slave to your money. Mark Hoberson has given us another challenge where we have to carry a hundred dollar bill for 90 days and it has to be in the front of our wallet where we see it every time we open that wallet up. So the temptation is always right there in our face. This particular hundred dollar bill has been with me for a couple of years. So I thought, well, this challenge is going to be a cinch. Because now this has been tucked away where I couldn't see it for those couple of years. I just knew it was there. And it was like a security blanket, but not right out there where it was screaming at me, spend me, spend me, spend me every time I open my wallet. Now, we'll see how I make out. I did put a little little mark on it so you can tell that it's going to be the same hundred dollar bill can't re can't spend it and then replace it it's got to be the same hundred dollar bill at the end of 90 days and at the end of 90 days we're supposed to be able to go buy ourselves something special with that but when I started carrying this hundred dollar bill went into stores and just walk up and down the aisles and look at things and say I can afford that. I can afford that. I just choose not to buy that. And look at all the things that you want, things that you'd like to have, and say, I can afford that. I just choose not to today. When you are walking up and down those aisles, there's a mind shift because so often we tell ourselves we can't afford something. When you walk in and you look around and you say, I can afford that, then you are having a mind shift. You are reprogramming your mind instead of in a poverty mode or in a debt mode. Now you have shifted and you're you're going into a prosperity mode. You're taking control. You're saying, I can afford that. I just choose not to today. There's a huge difference in the mind shift. And we are, if you have been in that mode of debt, poverty, just beaten down financially, then this is a great exercise to overcome that feeling of lack is to go in and say yes I can afford that I choose not to today I just choose not to buy that today it then becomes a choice and not a lack I have spent this hundred dollar bill over and over again. So this $100 bill right now is not just a $100 bill to me. That $100 bill is worth thousands of dollars to me because I have gone in and said, yeah, I, I can buy that. I just choose not to. This particular $100 bill has a lot of meaning to me because of that particular training and exactly what Mark Hoverson is suggesting in this challenge is it really learn to make money your slave instead of the other way around and on a on a side note just as something cute this one here has been with me for 13 years now yes it's only half of a 20 but it has a cute story behind it my mother was had a 
she was being honored in the Grange for being an active member for 75 years. And I don't know if how many of you know what the Grange is, but in her day, it was really a place for social. It was for um, the farmers, and it was an organization that helped farmers. And so they do a lot of good things in the community. And so at these events, they do things like cakewalks and play music and all that. And when they do these cakewalks, you have to put in a little money. And my sister and I, one of us paid for the other, and she came to me and said, I want to pay my half. I didn't have any extra change. And I said, okay. And, and I tried to tell her, no, I didn't want her money. And she insisted that we, we split it. I said, okay. And I tore the $100 bill back and gave her a change. Hence, we both have been carrying this $20 bill around for 13 years so that we were supposed to take each other out to lunch. We've been out to lunch many times together, but neither of us can part with this $20 bill. Money is not my master. Money is my slave. This can be a lot of fun. You can make you can be the master over your money and make money your slave. If you'd like to join me in this challenge or know more about what we do at ILN and the Internet Lifestyle Network, message me, click the links below. Let's get together and have some fun. Make it a great day. Peace and success. Kathleen Packard here.